Well, here we are on day eight. We missed day seven, so we're going to open up two today, Rolo and myself. So let's get started. Welcome back to Sweet Treasures by Cindy. I think we're going to go for this one. Maybe some top ones. We haven't done many top ones, a lot of bottom ones. So let's give it a go. We're going to find where that opening is. Oops, I'm starting to open that one. Oh, okay. Oh, that's a shiny one. Let's take a look close up. Has almost like an amber red look to it. Let's go to the next one. Let's get up here with Rolo. Ooh, this looks shiny too. Let's put that one down. Let's go. Let's focus in here. Kind of a shiny green. This one. Let's hold them up to the light. So yeah, I'm just kind of taking a look here and seeing, um, now that we saw pictures of them, I'm not sure if that green one was, refers to the green aventurine or the amber looking one. It's a brightly colored, dense and tough quartzite or secondary rocks in the crust are collectively referred to as dongling stones. When I read this the other night, there was one over here that said that same type of description, but it's an oil green quartzite containing chromium mica and its color is very beautiful. So these are the ones for day seven and eight. Really pretty. Um, I think what we'll have to do by the ending of it all is kind of see if we can classify them all through the legend. Uh, looks like glass beads to me. I'm not sure how these are stones, but we'll figure it out when we get through them all. Thanks for joining. We'll see you on day nine tomorrow. Bye for now.